Why can't I pick you up, Clucker? I was able to for a second. Okay. There. <gasps> Wait, he died? Oh. Oh, no. Oh, my God, this guy. You know what? I'm going to actually try and fight. Oh, Jesus. Okay, this is... How's it going, guys? Stray here, and welcome back to the high seas with my buddy Jerry. We can carry Jerry if we want to. That made a rhyme. That's absolutely awesome. But yes, welcome back, guys. If you missed the last episode, we got two new residents on our boat. Sergeant Cluxworth, or sorry, I'm still getting used to the name Sergeant Clucker. May Clucker ever rest in peace. And we also got good old Jerry here. Now, Jerry, as you can see, a little bit sad. I think he's actually homesick. Uh, that or he's too dumb to figure out where the grass is, and yes, okay, Jerry's just a little easy. He's not the brightest tool in the shed, you know? And now he's standing up straight, so yeah, it looks like that was Jerry's problem there. We are growing some more grass now, but yeah, welcome back to Raft, guys. Today we're gonna get back out and once again look for some more animals. We got one more to get, and uh, hopefully we can find it today. I also obviously gotta go kill some more blowfish, because, uh... Yeah, we need more explosive powder. So yeah, today is all about hopefully finally getting the final animal. And I want to obviously upgrade this place a little bit as well. Uh, we got a lot of dirt that I haven't put down yet, so we may as well start with that. I'm also thinking we might add two more pens and have a pen for each animal. Let me know what you guys think of that. We might end up doing it anyways, depending on how many animals we get. But I like the idea of maybe splitting this off into two and having two cages up here too to uh, house these guys. So yeah, if we don't get that done today, let me know in the comments below what you guys think about that. So we're going to start off by getting some dirt. We got lots of dirt right now, so we can build a bunch of those plots. All we need now is, uh, well, we're going to need some planks, that's for sure, and a little bit of plastic. So it looks like we'll get six new plots. That's double what we currently have, so that's perfect. And uh, let's get some plastic in the inventory here, because we may as well utilize some of that. We also probably have a lot to loot down here. And yes, as you can see, as per usual, no problem at all with mats. That should be more than enough for what we want to do right now. So let's go up and get these guys some more grass, because, yeah, they, they have a really hard time finding it. So I might actually spread it out. Let's put a row in, in the middle for right now. Okay, so there we go. We got six plots. So, yeah, we're just going to... I will definitely spread these out a little bit right now. In a perfect world, we'll have this whole thing... Uh, just a bunch of grass, and we will get there soon, but dirt is hard to come by as well, obviously, so we're gonna have to take our time to get there. Now that we have so many things to water, though, and I don't think, uh, raining will help out now that we have the roof, we are going to have to get bigger methods of water. I think we're just gonna have to get another one of these. I still don't know what the bucket does. I really feel like it should work as a better water bottle, basically. But I haven't been able to use it there, so we'll have to figure that out later. Anyways, let's water these crops. And then, yeah, I guess we're going to have to put down another water purifier. All right, so we're going to have to make some glass to make that purifier. So I'm going to grab a bunch of stuff here. I know to make glass, we need sand. And we should have some sand in the storage here. It should be in this one, I believe. Uh, yes, yeah, so we actually got quite a bit of sand. So perfect. No big deal. Uh, Clucker. The hell you doing, man? <laughs> Oh, Cluck, are you, are, you, are you hungry, man? I think he's trying to walk here. So, yes, the pathing for the animals is not the best. Um, Why can't I pick you up, Clucker? I was able to for a second. Okay. There. <gasps> Wait, he died? How did I lose Cluck? Did you kill him? Jerry! I'm so confused. Did he get stuck in the pool? I thought he was just tripping out inside the pool. I didn't realize he was dead and I was laughing at him. God, that's sick. All right, well, clearly I can't keep Cluckers alive. Uh, Jerry, best of luck, man. Best of luck. That's all I gotta tell you. Can I, uh, okay, I can't actually shear you right now. Well, god damn it. What do I, I don't know. Did he starve to death? I'm wondering if he got stuck on this pole trying to eat this, and he couldn't get over to it, and he starved to death. I don't know, but it didn't take long. We were, we were only gone for, like, half a day, and he was dead. God damn. Well, I don't know if we'll ever be able to get all the animals, because clearly I'm really good at killing cluckers. God damn it, Bruce. Every freaking time I come down here, I swear to God. All right, well, Jerry's going to be living life up there, I guess. So we got our glass sheets now. How this makes glass sheets, by the way, I have no idea, but it's freaking magic. All right, and we're just going to put this one in front of that one. We may as well keep everything together here, and it's as easy as going over here to fill these things up. 
So yeah, I gotta say, Jerry seems much happier now that Clucker is gone. I feel like maybe you can't actually have the animals together. I'm actually thinking maybe Jerry did kill uh, S Sergeant Clucker. That would have been really sucky. Whoa, we just hit a bunch of waves, didn't we, buddy? So yeah, I guess we'll start building some more cages for these guys over here. So we're gonna need lots of timber, though, so we'll slowly do it over time. Uh, we are on our way to our first island, at least hopefully it's an island, so hopefully we can get lucky and get that soon. Not finding too many resources, as you can see right now, so it's gonna be a bit of a slow start. Alright, so let's do the plank fences out here, because it doesn't really make sense. Like, thatch gate you'd need nails for? Why would you not just do plank for everything? Unless you really want it to look like green, it's just with the nail cost, it's not worth it. Even this isn't worth it. It's like... Two more rope than an ordinary plague fence. So, yeah, I, I like the look of these anyway, so at least we got that going for us. Now, I think I'll put a gate right here, because uh, that's usually where we're running from. And, yeah, we're going to make these nice and big, go all the way around this place. We'll be able to do maybe half of one right now. But, yeah, we'll just connect these together with a middle gate, and this should be perfect for, you know, the rest of my animals when we whenever we can get them and not kill them. Uh, looks like Jerry's ready for a sheer job. Here you go, Jerry. Oh, I am full inventory right now. So where can I put these name tags? Because we got one. We didn't get one for the original Clucker. That guy just randomly vanished. But we at least got one for Sergeant Clucker. Uh, so I think if we go downstairs, maybe we can put it like a memory wall of all our animals. I'm thinking this wall over here. If we can even do that. Please tell me we can. Yes! Okay, this is going to be the most depressing wall. Because, uh, cause, yeah, I see myself losing a lot of these guys. So rest in peace, Sergeant Clucker. You were a great guy. Jesus. Oh, my God. This this storm that we're in right now is absolutely ridiculous. Okay, I forgot I had some uh, planks in my inventory as well. So we should be good to probably finish up the majority of this now. May as well go do it. We are getting close to an island. It should be directly over here somewhere. So I'll keep an eye as I'm building. Let's get this fence done real quick, so when we are ready, we should have the space for these new animals. And I, I really like this idea, having our whole front is just a thing just for the animals. And look at that, a loot raft as well. May, may as well go try and get this. Oh god, don't sink. Oh, oh, oh no, no, give me the loot! Ha, okay, I should have just stayed in my boat because it would have went in there. Oh god, okay, Bruce, probably somewhere around here. He's probably pretty hungry as well. He hasn't attacked me in a while. Okay, I didn't realize you could get through that hole. I guess you can now. Whoa. Whoa. Look at the freaking size of that. Holy crap. This is like a tower of dirt. Jesus. Okay, well, I'm kind of excited to explore this island. I've never seen one this tall. Can we make it to the top? I don't know, but I hope so. Now, what we gotta find right now is blowfish. That's the first thing we gotta worry about. Um, are we close enough yet? No, let's wait. Let's get a little bit closer. You never know where Bruce is out here. Ah, this should be fun. This is a giant island. Like, we've saw large islands before, but nothing quite like that. Jesus. I'll bring the axe with me. You never know what we're going to need out there. Um, let's get rid of those nails, actually. Let's, let's, let's keep this organized. I'm very disorganized, naturally, so really trying to keep myself organized here, and it's not the easiest thing for me. Um, you know what? I'm gonna fill up that water bottle and bring that with us. Water bottles aren't too hard to make. And I think that's all we really need. I mean, obviously, we need the uh, net launcher, but we need explosives before we take that on the island. Okay, so let's get down here. Where's the Bruce at? Oh, he's already seeing me. Great. Certain not strong. It's actually turning nighttime. Oh my god, the hog is right there, too. I'm stuck between two apex predators right now. Yeah, you know what? We should probably actually head back to the boat, sleep it out for tonight. Let's just take a quick dip, see if we can maybe get lucky. Yeah, no. We're just gonna get attacked by Bruce if we stay out here too long. Not seeing Bruce anywhere. It's a little dark right now, but it should lighten up once the storm goes away. Right now, I'm gonna get to the coastline, explore the shallow areas of this island, and hopefully we can get one explosive powder. I gotta say, this island is extremely weird. Now, usually you got, like, these coral areas, like, in the shallows parts of it. It kind of is the same uh, below water as it is above. It's just really steep, and I can't find, like, any of the coral. Now, we're going quite deep, as you can see, and yeah, there's nothing down there. It's just like a dry bed, and that's not where the uh, blowfish are. We got to get lucky. Oh, God. Oh, that was the bird. Okay, great. Whoa, I don't know what happened there. But yeah, okay, so here's some. I mean, there's a little bit around, but you got to get real lucky to get blowfish on these areas. So if you have more of them, you got a better chance. And I'm not seeing anything here. Uh, oh, God. Getting a little nervous. <gasps> there's one. 
Okay, you know what? I'm gonna bring him to me. I hope Bruce isn't behind me. I haven't looked, but there we go. There we go. Just first try. Can we get it? That would be amazing. Come on. Okay, he's dead. Ah! I'm gonna have so many of these puffer fish heads. Oh, you're not a puffer fish! You're not a puffer fish! I'm running- I should have attacked him. Ah, uh, it's, been, it's been a while, Bruce. It's been nice without you. <gasps> wow, this guy is really deep. Okay, come on, I need at least one. Oh god, I'm just waiting for Bruce as well. I am really deep right now, so we're gonna have to get this guy and get up quickly. Come on, there we go. Gimme it! Ah, oh, there we go, that's what I'm talking about. Ah! Oh god, okay. Can't be comfortable on land or water in this game. I mean, now with the damn hog as well. God, there's just nowhere that's safe for me. Oh, yeah, I got another one as well. Talk about a lucky day. This island, or whatever the hell, it doesn't even look like an island. It looks like a friggin' mud castle or something. But it has a lot of puffers around, and I'm not certain, but I feel like they respawn, because I feel like I saw one at this part before. So I think if we wait around here long enough, too, we might actually be able to get multiples. Don't quote me on that, though. Is that another one in the distance? God damn, man! I'm finding all the puffers now. Maybe they added more because they realized how impossible this was. Well, it wasn't impossible. It was just extremely difficult to get any sort of explosive powder. Oh, hey, Bruce. What's up, dude? Thanks for not, you know, bothering me. That was oh, God. Oh, this freaking shadow scares me. Okay, let's get this quick. Another one! Oh, my God! All right, so we're already at three. We've killed four and we've gotten three. Maybe they increased the, the yield as well. I have no idea, but that should be more than enough for right now. Looks like we got another llama on this island. I was hoping to find the new guy. You know what? Being that we're here, let's go explore this a little bit. Just gotta watch out for that hog. All right, what's up, llama, llama dude? I might get you later as well. I mean, we could always have a mate, right? I wonder if they... Wouldn't that be great if they make kids? I doubt it. Um, Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna start gathering some of these as well because you never know when we want to paint my raft. Oh, I forgot my spade. All right, we'll have to come back here, but we do have some dirt at least, that's good. And the old cave mushrooms. Okay, so back to hunting. We know we got a llama there. Not exactly what I want, but I'll take what I can get. And we got our ammo set up now, so that's good. Uh, made myself another metal spear as well. Let's actually, wait, what? I thought, oh, I didn't bring it out. Oh, I don't have enough stone, that's why. There we go, now we got the extra net canister as well, so we should be good to at least go get that llama. Hopefully we get lucky and we can indeed get that. Let me make sure Jerry's okay up there, he was complaining a bit earlier. He actually like ate all the freaking grass. Looks like he's good now, I rewatered all the stuff. He seems to be, well actually he seems, he looks kind of angry, but he'll just have to deal with it. He's just an angry guy, you know? I mean, look, look. <laughs> Uh, I, I love the fact that our, our one animal is a freaking llama. Like, what else could be more derpy than that? Okay, but it's hunting time, and man, do we have a large island to explore right now. I didn't really get much time yesterday to explore this one. We know we got the llama, but uh, if I could find a sheep, that would be great. Still haven't even seen one, so I don't know if they're, like, extremely rare or if they're hidden. Who the hell knows, but uh, I'm going to keep my eye out see if we can see one today. Oh, God, easy now, buddy. It is designed to make you go all the way up, I think. Yeah, it looks like we can climb right here. So, yeah, this is totally a pathway up. I'm excited, man. I've never been to an island like this. Still got a ways to go. We are so high up already. And this guy is extremely angry with me right now. Please don't attack me. Because I'm, like, up at his flying territory now. He's trying to grab more rocks, trying to take me down. But as long as I keep moving, we should be okay. Wait, is this a dead end? No, we still got a ways to go. Okay. Uh, not much of a trail left. Oh, no. Come on! Let me... Oh, God! I shouldn't be doing this. This is dangerous. We're just gonna... Oh, no. We're just gonna rock crawl it up. Oh, there's gotta be a way to get up there. I mean, look at that! We can climb right there. So let, let's let's retrace our steps. See if we can maybe find a different way up. Okay, I think I found the way. Is that a goat? Did I just see a freaking goat? Yes, I did! That's where they are at the top of the mountains. It makes sense. What's up, dude? Gotcha! Oh, man, that feels great. Okay, we're still gonna go for a little walk, buddy. Because I gotta see what's up here. Now, if I stop carrying him, I worry that he'll run away. So, we'll go explore this, but I'm definitely not gonna drop this guy. We'll come back and loot anything that's up here. It's so cool that we can actually get up here, though. So, this is a new giant island. There's nothing like this. Um, 
And maybe it's the same as the other ones, it's just really weirdly laid out. So we gotta loot up there. What's at the top of this one, though? Look at the, look at the amount of climbing things we can do over here. Alright, Goat, we're going all the way to the top. Are you not impressed with me? I'm, I'm sure this is what you dream of doing. Being able to get up here, man. Okay, so yeah, we're almost up. Looks like it is clearly meant for us to go up here. Is there anything? A hut or anything up here? Okay, so yes, we do. Oh, wow. We got a satellite, guys. I've never seen that before and some loot here. Okay, so I'm going to take take my goat down because obviously this guy's pretty damn rare and I'm very excited about him. So let's bring him down first and uh, then we'll have to come back up here and explore this area. Oh, no. Not you. Leave me alone. I'm just looking for my boat. I can't I can never seem to find this giant thing. All right. I might need to jump in the water here because I don't want to deal with this hog bastard. My fear is uh, that my raft just kind of floats away on one of these islands, and I feel like this is exactly what's going on right now. I mean, it totally could happen. I could accidentally lift the anchor or something, and if I jump off the raft, it's long gone without me. So I've never had that happen before, and I'm hoping this isn't the first time it did because I seriously... God, this is a big island, though. I can't find it. All right, hop up before your Bruce meet. Don't want that to happen. We're going to throw you in... Oh, crap, I don't have... um. All right, we'll have to throw you with with your friend for a second because I don't have doors on the other place. Uh, oh god, oh no. Okay, goat, stay there for a second. I don't like that I can't open doors while holding these guys. Can I milk you? Is that what it just said? All right, looks like Jerry's okay over there. He's hanging out. Oh, that's what the freaking bucket's for for you. We're milking a goat. I expected cows, but all right. Okay, Jerry's been eating a lot, as you can see. Let's get this guy some food. Come on, e eat up. There you go, buddy. All right, I want to see if I can actually remove these things. Okay, so we do get to keep the grass plots. This is perfect. That means I can split these up now and not have to worry about one of my dudes starving. So we're going to bring these down real quick. I'll take four for our goat that I haven't named yet. And Jerry can have the majority of them as he is a bigger animal. <laughs> oh, you can just look over the fence. It's adorable. Okay, so there's one gate. There's another one. And now we are ready to go. I'm going to take a quick rest. And then we'll move our goat over and maybe go get that other llama. All right, goat. Did Jerry eat you like he did, Sergeant Cluxworth? No, you guys are good over here. You guys are friends, right? All right, I'm going to carry you. I guess I should name you as well. All right, so I'm going to throw you over in this pen. But before that, I got to think of a name. Goat Lord sounds good. Why the hell not? There we go. We have the Goat Lord with us now. Look at him. God, you are adorable. They did a really good job with these models. I mean, look how cute this guy is. Looks like we got another storm. This this island really likes its storms. Now, before I leave, let's get some plots down. I'm going to try and spread these out because these guys are really dumb. All right, so there you go. Hopefully one of those you'll actually eat. Uh, being that it's raining right now, perfect. I don't, I don't need to water these things or anything. All right, so Goat Lord is with us. Hopefully he stays there. I'm going to get away from you in case the bird attacks me. There he is. All right. On the grand voyage to chase this guy. Seriously. Oh, why do we got a mountain climb, dude? Well, I guess I got to go up there anyways. I was going to go get that dirt wherever it was. Actually, is it over here? Okay, hold on. Oh, I hate you. Oh, man. Okay, so it does have some range on it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Do it quick. Okay, I got him. Oh, oh, come here. Come on, I got to run. See you later. All right, not today, hoggy boy. I don't know where he is, but he didn't make it here. All right, well, welcome. Oh, crap, every freaking time. Okay, so we're going to open that up. Just still chill here for a second. There we go. Look at this. I found you a friend. It does have a different coat. Okay, I thought it looked a little bit different, so I'm assuming one's female and one's male. Why can I not close this? Okay, there we go. Let's make sure this is nice and closed for them. My God, you guys eat a lot. Jesus Christ, I'm going to have to really pay attention up here, especially if we get any more, because these things are going to go down so quickly. Goat Lord seems to be totally happy. Oh, I forgot the bucket. I should go grab that. It looks like this is already watered perfect. So, yeah, I think if there's a roof on top of them, they do not water, unfortunately. And that's going to be a big problem when we have a lot of animals up here. Like I said, I'm assuming this one's a female or, or Jerry's a female, but this one's going to be Larry anyways. Jerry and Larry? Hell yeah, dudes. Oh, oh no. Oh, my God, this guy. You know what? I'm going to actually try and fight. Oh, Jesus. Okay, this is this is why I don't fight this guy. But yeah, you know what? I've had enough of your stuff. Oh, yeah, there we go. Hit him. And keep running back and forth. Because I've never been able to kill this guy. No idea what it gives. Come on, dude. Okay, 
Okay, so we just gotta be extremely careful. Whoo! Okay, you were you judged ahead of time there. Yeah, there we go! <laughs> ah, all right, I got him. I got the warhog. Or sorry, warthog head. Should call him a warhog though. God damn. All right, can we actually put this on our head? People say we can. Oh my god, we actually can. All right, let me actually get out. Oh yeah, look at me now. <laughs> I wonder if warthogs will fear me now. By the way, there is third-person view. I just never use it. I mean, she kind of walks funny. To be fair, I have flippers on her still, so that's to be expected. You know what? Let's finish this off in third person with my new warthog head. Hell yeah! All right, in the grand voyage up, back to the top. All right, so this is the smaller part. This is things that we've seen before, but that satellite dish... I don't recall ever seeing a satellite dish on an island before, so... There might be some good loot over there. Let's just grab this real quick. There should be a bunch of stuff that we need. Yeah. Does this thing say anything on it? I mean, this is so weird. All right, little anticlimactic, gotta be honest. But uh, hey, sometimes it is. That's just what we gotta accept. Uh, so yeah, we can't actually... Wait, what was that? Oh, I think that was... Yeah, it was just the red berries behind it. Uh, I was hoping we could use this or something. It doesn't look... Like, there's no battery slots or anything. We can't bring a battery up here and get use out of it. So yeah, never seen that before though. Cool. Oh, hey! I got leather, and I think I got it from the hog, so that's where leather comes from, of course! I was seriously worried, like, we had the option to maybe kill our animals for leather. I didn't want that to be the case. Maybe it is the case, but if I gotta kill hogs for leather, that's totally fine. So now we actually got some of this stuff. You know what? Let's sleep so it's daytime, because uh, everybody hates watching a video when it's dark out. And let's unlock the final few recipes that I haven't been able to do thanks to this leather. So there we go. Research that. Look at this. We can make leather freaking armor now and a backpack, which is obviously really exciting. And I think that's officially everything. Okay, and we need some more. Oops. Easy now. That's the important stuff. We got a lot of dirt actually on this island, so that worked out. Now we need... We're going to need some more planks, of course. Let's organize this real quick as per usual. We just need a little bit of planks to make this grass plots. Now, I don't know really where I want to put these because we definitely don't have as many at the goat plot. What? Oh, God, that, that's the bird scared me. I thought it hit my goat for some reason. Uh, we don't have many at the grass plot, but obviously the llamas are going to be eating more than him. And as well, uh, water will refill his, where these guys, as you can see, this guy's hungry right now. So, yeah, I think to be safe, we're going to try and get this one a little bit more spread out. All right. There you go, Jerry. Get out of the way. I understand you're sad right now. But yeah, we'll put three up there, and I think two by our goat. Our goat seems totally fine with what he has, but the more the merrier. So there we go. We'll throw that one there, and then we'll throw one right over there like so. All right. That feels good, man. Let's go water these things. All right. Now the moment we've all been waiting for. Well, at least I've been waiting for. Where the hell's my bucket? Oh, no. Did I lose it? Yeah, there it is. Now this is an actual tool now that we can use. So let's go, uh... Milk our goat! Oh my god, alright, here we go. Oh, okay, no, that's that's weird. Okay, hold on. Just gonna... Yep, there we go. Bucket of milk! <laughs> oh, dude, can I drink it? Oh my god, I can actually... That's kind of gross. Alright, whatever. I I'm gonna drink your milk. Let's see what it gives. Not much. I think that's more for uh, cooking than anything else. You can see that little green bar on my food now. That's what cooking's all about. So I think, yeah, that's more for re recipes than anything else. Speaking of recipes, we actually got a couple more. Let's put those on the wall. But yeah, as you can see, like, we got a uh, fish stew. We need the milk for that. So I think when it comes to cooking, the goat will be really helpful. Right now, he doesn't really do too much besides look absolutely adorable. All right, guys, but I think that's a good time to end off another episode of Raft. Really good episode today. We uh, did a lot to the Raft once again, added more cages to this thing. Finally saw the final new animal, which is Goat Lord himself, the goat. And I gotta say, this island was a pleasant surprise as well, because it's been totally different from the other ones, and it is absolutely giant. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Next episode, we got that leather, so I want to equip ourselves with some of that armor and see how good it truly is. Uh, so that's probably what we'll be focusing on next, and obviously getting as many animals as possible. So thanks so much for watching and liking, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.